Good day, Simmers. Welcome once again to Samantha's Free Play channel. And uh, for this episode, we are going to be testing um, some of the glitches that I have already uploaded uh, to my YouTube channel. And um, we're doing that because we had our latest update, the Shabby Chic update. So we're going to try to check and see if... Um, if this are still working, if they're working differently, or if they're no longer working. And we're going to start off with the duplication glitch. Now, the build in the background, that's just for the background. Um, this is a cafe that I have um, built recently. But this, uh, this is actually a build I'm going to be doing in a different lot. But that's not... What we're gonna be talking about today so let's move on to testing out the duplication glitch and I want to start out with the life orb now for the life orb let me go ahead and check which ones I have available for duplication and based on my inventory I have this bronze life orb right here, so we're going to use that. And we'll start out with creating the room. So we all know that for the duplication glitch, it's really important that you follow the sequence because that can usually ruin the glitch if you don't follow it. So you have to follow that in order. Okay, so first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to create or build the first room which is a one by four and then another room beside it which is a three by four and then we exit the room mode and then we start adding the materials or equipment that's going to help us with the duplication glitch so we start with the wall TVs. You can use, um, sorry, I should click TV and cinema. You can use two different types of wall TVs or two of the same. So I'm gonna just gonna use the white ones to place this against the wall to the right of the first room, and then um, we are going to start testing the this glitch using the cupboard and then later because there's another way if you don't have the cupboards that can hold table items you can actually use mirrored sinks the ones of course that can hold items as well so let me go to countertops Okay, let's filter that and let's go ahead and use the newer ones which is the cream and white from the Tutti Frutti update actually I'll just use one since anyway I only have one life orb left if you have two then you can use two cupboards so in this case I'll use one okay and then we also get a dining table. I'm gonna use the pink one. So I usually use this. Okay. And then we pull out the life orb that we are duplicating again I'm using the bronze life orb that's the first one on top I'm gonna place it on the cupboard we exit the life orb folder go into room mode and then we try or we try to size up the first room to a 2x4 and then cancel. As you can see, 
the cupboard is now blinking that's the start of the glitch and we will have to move the orb our life orb to the table do not drag you need to tap or tap and then place it on the table and then go back to room mode attempt to size down the second room down to a one by three by moving the arrow up and then releasing by clicking the X to cancel and as you can see we already have a couple of them one on the cupboard and then one on the table and as always we have to check and make sure that it worked so we don't do anything with the life orbs that's on the ground we go back into inventory and then we click on the life orb and as you can see instead of 65,000 just like what happened with Tutti Frutti um, it actually will show you um, uh, lifestyle points 70 for this particular life orb so what we can do is we exit from here right we don't do anything we get out of the lot let's see if it's gonna work and then we go back in the lot and once we're back in we go into the home store into the inventory click the life orb it's still showing 70 lifestyle points so the next thing we're gonna need to do is we click the three dots right here on the lower right hand corner and then click this button right here the one that's gonna say you're gonna exit and then it will ask you if you want to exit and it will be auto saved and then you click yes we just need to go back in okay so once we're back in let us again check the inventory see if it's gonna work there so as you can see the bronze life orb now has 65,535 life orbs duplicated so I read some comments or maybe it was a post um, suggesting although it was not I think it was not a life orb it was like a table item let's see if that's gonna happen to the life orb they tried selling um, the item but it won't sell so currently I have 55,393 um, I'm sorry 55,393,776 simoleons so let's see if it's gonna go up and if it's gonna affect the bronze life orb that we have in the inventory so I'm gonna sell one which should sell to 40,000 let's see if the 776 at the end if it's gonna change so sell yes as you can see it went up um, I'm not sure I was able to watch it but because um, it's still showing 776 um, but the the 65,000 is not affected for the bronze life orb. So let's try to sell the second one. So let's watch the 400, uh, 433,776 if it's going to change. Yes, it was 433,776. It's now 473. 776 
Now I'm gonna try to sell from the inventory. We sell one. So the last six numbers we're seeing on the on my simoleons is four seven three seven seven six. If we sell another forty thousand, yes, it's going up. So you can see five thirteen seven seven six, and the number of live orbs was just minus by one. Okay, so what I would do is to save. Save this progress, upload it to the cloud, and then I'm going to exit. But this time, I won't be using that same exit earlier. I'm just going to click the menu button and then go back. So we have gone back in and this will be the last test I will do for this initial duplication glitch. Let's go back into the inventory and then check if our life orb is safe and sound. It's still there. I still have the bronze life orb. This is the, ge the, the one for the geeky personality and it's still 65,534. So that, that to me is a uh, it's still a working glitch however it just has a slight difference when you do it initially it will show you lifestyle points instead of the 65k but if you do the save and exit and then you go back um, it will already give you not not just exit from the lot but you have to exit completely from the game you use the save and exit button and then go back in and the 65,000 plus is gonna stay and you're able to sell it as per usual so we're gonna move on to um, doing the duplication using the mirrored sink on the next episode